compositions of his own uh, by David Clayman, Ignaz Friedman, and our very own Julia Lawrence. Um, he's going to talk about it if he wants to throughout the set and tell you what he's doing. And towards the end of the set, or the second half of the set, Pandelis and I are going to come up here and we're going to join him for a trio improvisation with John on the first set. Uh, Pandelis has this um, really cool keyboard that has a microtonal scale programmed into it. So that should be totally fun. And that's what's going to happen on the first set. And of course, we got a second set with a, a great quartet. So thanks for coming. So I'm going to start with a pair of pieces. And I just want to say thanks to Eric and Pendelis. I'm here to learn from them. Uh, so I'm really looking forward to that. Uh, so I'll play a piece of mine and then a piece by David Clayman as a pair. Then one more piece of mine, and then I'll talk.
So thanks. That's uh, part one. And uh, so those pieces were uh, Lamp to Self, that's the first one, um, Brief Musical Refuge in the Mind. And then uh, David Clayman's piece is called Three Fortune. It's based on a Phil Oaks song, Three But for Fortune. And it was composed for a concert of Oaks interpretations by different composers. Uh, it was, it, he made some transformations to the song, preserved the melody, played on the title, um, changed the time from 3 4 to 4 4, and used chordal harmony. And then my second piece is called In So Doing. And it's, if it's about something, it concerns itself with the apparently unceasing process of searching and finding at the keyboard, or maybe just searching and searching more. Uh, and it was composed for somebody else, a pianist called Mae Fong, who premiered it in October. And so we were um, thinking we were going to be playing with um, Carlos Mauro, um, who played, who's a, a Peruvian uh, composer who's working with me now. And uh, he was going to bring his cana and his guitar, but he got sick. So uh, when I heard that, which was, what, two nights ago, um, I thought, all right, what? A, what would we do? So um, we kind of rerouted this second part here. And so what you're going to hear is a, a piece called that, that I put together called Would Have Been to Carlos. And uh, I was writing a piece for him anyway, so I just thought, OK, I'll, I'll sort of pull, that, pull this off somehow. So um, I used some of the material that we might have used um, where we improvise together. Uh, and then I'm going to lead from that into a piece that I wrote for my mother called Reverie in the Plaid Chair. She's quite elderly and she nods off in a plaid chair or a brown recliner or a gray recliner. It depends on what she's sitting in. So um, this is called Reverie in the Plaid Chair. Also, when I was dealing with Carlos not being able to come, uh, another student got in touch with me and said, Oh, you should. Listen to this piece by Ignace Friedman. Um, it, I love it, and it would go really well with this piece of yours uh, that he knew. So I'm not going to play that piece, but I thought, all right, I'll put it in. Um, so uh, what's going to start to happen around that time is um, I am going to kind of improvise my way out of the Ignaz Friedman piece, which I'll play. And this is circa 1905. It was written in 1905. Uh, and move into Julia's piece, Tantrum, which um, I've been playing a few times recently, in which Julia wrote for me in 2001. Um, what was it? The Tantrum was um, uh, about some problems at, the ba at, at a bakery. But, um, it uh, led to some more serious ideas of what a tantrum could be. So, and then from tantrum, we're going to go into improv. And so, um, I think Eric and Pendelis are going to join me, and I'm just going to play for a while, and then uh, we'll, it's going to go more and more to free. I guess I'll say once again how cool it is to have John coming here and, and, and performing these pieces uh, with us. It's, it's, it's totally great. I can't thank you enough.
Future. Oh yeah. <laughs> uh, we're gonna going. we're gonna we're gonna set up for the second set. Eric Barber is gonna play saxophone. Brittany Carlson on the bass. Pam Elise on the piano, and myself on the drums. We're gonna do an improvised music set. Thank you. <laughs> 